everybody. So, as you can probably guess, this is a pretty experimental video. Um, I mentioned a couple of videos ago that I was going to try to do a video like this. A couple of you requested it, but I also said that I liked watching these videos too, the few that are on YouTube. Um, Dental Whispering has made one or two driving videos. I believe Blade Whisper Pro has as well. Um, so I'm just going to be taking a little drive and whispering or softly speaking to you as I go. I figured I would do soft spoken because, you know, we're in the car and the engine is pretty loud, I guess. At least it's going to sound loud on my microphone. Although I'm trying to drive very slowly. Um, so, yeah, I don't know how this is going to go. But we're just going to try and see how it goes. I was really excited to make this kind of video, or at least try to, because I remember being younger and I would almost always pass out in the car. It would just make me sleepy. I don't know if it was the lull of the engine or the motion. I don't know what it was. So, Maybe some of you can relate as well. So I'm going to try to kind of stay on the back roads where I know I can go a little slower. This is a 
super, super windy road. Oh wow, but it's so smooth. <laughs> I don't think I have driven on the street in a while. So they probably just paved it not that long ago. Which would be nice for the winter time. Look at all these trees. Literally, there's like not one leaf on them. It's so sad. That means that snow is coming. Can you imagine like driving up these windy, hilly roads with snow and ice? It's not fun. I did it last year for the first time and uh, it's pretty rough. My little car here, it's a lot for him to handle. Um, I'm filming this video as like my last tribute to this car because I'm not gonna have him for much longer. I've mentioned to you guys that I have been car shopping. Um, it's just time and I need a car that is all-wheel drive that can, you know, deal with the snow and the ice. So, it's just time. Okay, so I just turned around off camera because it was kind of loud. I found like a random gravel driveway <laughs> um, and I just made a little U-turn. So we're going to head back the other direction. So we're going to kind of start to see uh, the same things again, just from a different perspective. So we're going the other way now and you're going to be able to see up people's driveways and we're going to see that pretty lake again. This was just an, an experimental video, like I said. Um, if it goes well, which I honestly won't know until I sit down and edit it. Um, oh wow, this actually does look really, it looks prettier from this perspective, like going this way. I don't know if it's just me, but um, anyway. Yeah, if it goes well, I'd like to do like a driving at nighttime version. Um, and that would probably be with my new car. Um, so you guys can just let me know what you think about that. This right here, I don't know if you can see it, but there's a little farmer's market right there that I've never been in. I've actually never seen it before. I've never noticed it. I should go there. Me, they will all tell you that I'm a very fast driver. 
for it. But I know that they know that I'm still, I'm a good driver. Just because I'm fast doesn't mean I'm not safe. But I am purposely going slow. Slowish. For the purposes of this video. When I was little, my mom and I used to go on a lot of road trips to like go see family and stuff. And it was usually like a three to three and a half hour drive. And I would always sit right back there where you guys are sitting and she would sit here and she would drive. And I would just, like I couldn't help it. My eyes would start to get super heavy. And I would just, I would sleep for the whole car ride. Anyone who has seen me <laughs> from another car while I've been filming this has probably been like, what the actual heck? <gasps> A squirrel just ran in front of me, but he made it. That was scary. Um, but yeah, these people are probably like, what in the heck is this person doing? Um, oh, people have scarecrows up and pumpkins. That's so cute. And they like stuffed them with leaves. I never did that as a kid. That's really cute. It's very festive-like. Oh, okay. We have one little obstacle here. I have to go around this dude. Landscapers. Landscapers always find a way to ruin my videos somehow. I'm just kidding. It's okay. But anyway, guys, like I said, this was a very experimental video. Um, so let me know what you guys thought people checking their mail okay but anyway guys any feedback you have is definitely welcomed if I even end up posting this at all um, but yeah thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you